Chiedza is in Leeds to meet with 200 other single Muslims from around the country. They'll be attending an in-person dating event put on by a large Muslim dating app. I'm nervous because I don't know, like, will I meet anyone that I like? Will it be good? Um, so I definitely am nervous because I'm going to be, be meeting a bunch of people for the first time. It's like learning to ride a bike or driving for the first time. There's always those first nerves. But I'm sure I'll get on fine once I'm... In the flow. In the flow of it. See how it goes. And I think, you know, your attitude walking into something can really sometimes, you know, help determine the outcome. So I think a positive attitude and a positive mindset is going to be the right thing and right approach for me to take this evening. Muz has held live events in London, Paris and New York. This is the first event they're putting on in Leeds. OK, so what are you looking for in a future partner? Somebody who is a family person, who loves mum and dad, who loves his family, because I love my parents as well, so that would be brilliant. A team of chaperones dressed in their signature pink help with introductions, social media updates, and most importantly, keeping it all halal. Hello, Hello I'm Chadda, how are you? Nice to meet you. I'm Chadda, how are you? Good, yeah, good thing. Is this your first time at an event? Yeah, very yeah. first time. How Interesting. Are you Nervous, nervous, don't know what to expect, Aww. but it should be fun. It should be fun. I'm nervous. Nice to meet you. I don't know what to expect. The event starts with mocktails and mingling. And Chiedza asks the guy next to her to guess where she's from. Everyone says Nigeria. you got to guess it. Like, It's not Nigeria or Ghana. It's in West Africa. No. No. no, the best part. The West? No. South? Yeah. South African? Yeah. No, I'm not South African. I'm from the South of Africa. All right. What is the country above South Africa? Above well, South Africa? Zed. Zimbabwe? Yeah. It was a free-flowing conversation. I think it was it was natural, and I think that's just down to the both of us, you know. It's the kind of people that we are. Conversationalists, you know, tend to be very, have an open body language and can talk about pretty much about anything, really. It felt really, really smooth. Host Gemma mixes things up with a little quiz. With a population of 37 million, the largest city in the world. Write it down. You've got 30 seconds. Tokyo! Has anyone got my eyes? Maybe. 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 Chiedza gets introduced to a guy she's spotted during the quiz. What's on your plans to so go to Iceland? Where else are you going? I've got Turkey. Yeah. And then I've got Iceland for November, my birthday. And like you said, like mini ones. Yeah. I'm going to Morocco. I'm surprised. It's only like a what, four hour flight? Chez is lovely. She's travelled extensively, whereas I've just started. I've been to Italy, so I've told her like some good destinations in Italy. Oh, that was actually a little bit fancy. I like that. <laughs> well, I actually did take a number. I've got a number in a group chat. So hopefully, I'll be um, talking to her soon. After a long evening, Chiedza heads back to her hotel. It was nice to see other people that were looking for the same um, thing that I was, which was ultimately, you know, love, which sort of like, you know, for me is a nice feeling that you're not the only one. So, yeah, the first guy that I spoke to, um, he came, he sat across from me and he just said, hi. I mean, he said like a nice, you know, very casual um, conversation. He was like super friendly, super out there, very easy to talk to. I also enjoyed talking to Mohammed. He might reach out to me. He's got my number and we will just see. Um, but yeah, hopefully he reaches out. Inshallah.